In a town named Blackford, the daytime sun and warm breeze concealed the darkness of the night. This town was a tranquil place where residents knew each other, and children played in the streets as if nothing out of the ordinary would ever happen. However, in this peaceful town, a series of unbelievable events had recently occurred. Children, one after another, mysteriously vanished, as if they were swallowed by the earth. Their mothers and fathers were filled with anger and despair, and their friends and neighbors were shocked and uneasy. The town descended into chaos as people gathered to search for their children. But there were no clues, no signs left behind, only children's toys, backpacks, and empty beds. At the central children's playground in the town, a girl named Amy had once been the source of laughter for the children. She, too, mysteriously disappeared. Her mother, Sarah, was one of the most heartbroken mothers in the town. Sarah stood in front of her daughter's bedroom door, gazing at the abandoned bed. She took a deep breath and looked around. While Blackford remained beautiful, it was now shrouded in anxiety and fear. Sarah knew she couldn't sit idly by, she had to find answers and recover her daughter. In this town, a horrifying nightmare had just begun, with the darkness of night casting its shadow, and a greater disaster seemed to be silently approaching. Despite the looming mystery of the missing children in the town of Blackford, life had to go on. The daytime sun still cast its warm glow, and the night sky continued to twinkle with stars. Yet, in the hearts of every resident, there lingered a profound unease. Every night, Sarah was plagued by the same recurring nightmare. In this dream, she found herself wandering through a dark and foreboding forest where the trees contorted into terrifying shapes, as if crafted by malevolent incantations. She relentlessly pursued a vague figure, always just out of her reach, hidden from view. Each time she neared it, she would jolt awake, drenched in sweat, her heart pounding. Determined to uncover the meaning behind these nightmares, Sarah decided to document the fragments of her dreams, searching for clues or at least attempting to decipher the hints they held. She began to notice that each dream was accompanied by distant, eerie chants, an otherworldly melody that seemed to beckon her. On one cold night, her dream presented a clearer vision. She saw herself standing in an ancient forest where the trees were twisted into unsettling forms. This scene felt familiar, as though it had a connection to some place within the town. Sarah couldn't shake the feeling that this was more than just a dream. It was a cryptic sign guiding her to seek answers. As daylight broke, she headed to the town's historical archive, sifting through ancient documents and maps, in pursuit of a location that matched the wooded landscape from her dreams. There, she discovered a place named Ghostly Grove, known as an ancient ritual site steeped in legends of concealed mystic powers. Her suspicions deepened, and she began to believe that Ghostly Grove might be linked to the missing children. She resolved to explore this enigmatic place, understanding that it would be a perilous adventure. Dark forces awaited her, ready to exact a high price. Sarah's decision marked the commencement of a perilous, enigmatic, and terrifying journey to uncover the truth behind the disappearances. In the town of Blackford, the echoes of her nightmares reverberated like phantoms, and a greater enigma lay on the horizon. In the town of Blackford, daytime warmth and tranquility sharply contrast with the darkness of the night. As night falls, the star-studded sky casts a faint glow that illuminates the town streets. However, this feeble light cannot dispel the prevailing unease and mystery that hang over the town. The streets appear silent and deserted, and narrow alleyways are desolate, filled with darkness. Only a few street lamps barely flicker in the night's serenity. Each street corner seems to be saturated with an oppressive silence, sending chills down one spine. The town's residents seek refuge in their homes, refusing to confront the horrors of the night. Yet, on this quiet night, Sarah stands at her doorstep, attentively listening to the eerie chant that emanates from the distance. This haunting sound appears to originate deep within the woods, bearing ominous omens. Her face reveals concern and tension, 
but also a hint of courage and determination. Every night, Sarah is haunted by the same nightmare, and this night's unease seems to intensify the terror within the dream. In her dream, she finds herself wandering through a dark forest, where the trees twist into horrifying shapes, as if molded by malevolent incantations. She pursues a blurry figure that always remains just out of her sight, refusing to reveal itself. Each time she comes close to touching it, she awakens, drenched in sweat, and her heart races. To unravel this mystery, Sarah decides to record fragments of these nightmares, searching for clues or attempting to decipher their meaning. She begins to notice that each dream is accompanied by a distant, eerie chant, a peculiar hymn that seems to be calling out to her. On a cold night, her dream presents a clearer vision. She sees herself standing in an ancient grove, the trees contorted into unsettling forms. This scene feels familiar, as if it is connected to some place within the town. Sarah believes that this is more than just a dream, it is a sign guiding her to seek answers. As daylight breaks, she heads to the town's historical archive, where she searches through ancient documents and maps, trying to locate a place that matches the forest in her dreams. She discovers a place known as the Grove of Spirits, a site associated with ancient rituals, rumored to conceal mysterious powers. Her suspicion deepens, and she begins to believe that the Grove of Spirits may be connected to the missing children. She decides to explore this place, unraveling the dark mystery. However, she realizes that this will be a perilous adventure, as dark forces may be waiting for her, ready to exact a heavy toll. Sarah's decision marks the beginning of a journey filled with danger, mystery, and terror as she seeks to unveil the truth behind the disappearances. In the town of Blackford, the echoes of her nightmares resonate like ghosts, and a larger enigma is on the verge of revelation. Sarah stood at the entrance to the ghostly grove, an ancient gate hanging before her, seemingly leading to an unknown realm. The mist enveloped the forest, casting doubt on her decision. She took a deep breath, pushed the gate open. It creaked, revealing a dark passageway. She illuminated it with her flashlight and entered the mysterious forest. Trees appeared even more twisted and threatening against the night's backdrop, as if concealing countless secrets. As she walked, she began to notice strange signs within the forest. A pile of stones formed peculiar symbols, exuding an ancient aura. Scattered beneath the trees lay broken items, seemingly related to rituals. Sarah slowly approached, attempting to understand the connection between these discoveries and the missing children. Suddenly, she heard a low growl, and the trees in the forest began to shake, as if infused with life. A mysterious presence appeared in the darkness, seemingly the guardian of the forest. Sarah's heart raced, but she remained fearless, knowing she must press on. As she ventured deeper into the forest, the mist thickened, as if she had entered another world. Here, the sounds grew more eerie, and she heard children's cries, but she couldn't pinpoint their source. Were they the missing children? Sarah tightly gripped her flashlight, her eyes fixed ahead, prepared to face whatever lay in wait. She felt as though she had entered an ancient, mysterious ritual site, filled with relics and incantations. In the darkness, she suddenly saw ghostly figures, were they the missing children? They stood in the distance, their faces blurred, as if beckoning to her. Sarah sprinted toward them, but they vanished into the darkness. This forest concealed countless mysteries, and Sarah's exploration had only just begun. Her determination remained unshaken, and despite the dark forces that seemed to await her, she would continue forward, not only to find the missing children but also to unveil the truth hidden within the forest. She understood that she would be fearless, unwavering, until she revealed the fate of the missing children and the secrets hidden in the woods. As Sarah delved deeper into the ghostly grove, she could sense the intense aura of mystery that pervaded the place. The trees were twisted, and the fog was thick, as if it were a gateway to another world. 
Despite the echoes of nightmares still reverberating in her ears, her determination grew stronger. She was determined to find the missing children and unveil the secrets hidden within the forest. With every step she took, strange sounds surrounded her, resembling the murmurs of ghostly whispers. Her heart raced, but she refused to falter. Suddenly, a ghostly shadow emerged from the woods, seemingly the spirit of the missing children. Sarah attempted to approach it, but it vanished before her eyes, leaving behind only a chilling breeze. This specter seemed to be guiding her, and she followed closely, navigating through the dense fog of the forest. As she delved deeper into the woods, she started to notice ancient mysterious markings, strange symbols carved into stones, and remnants of ancient ritual artifacts scattered on the ground. She realized that this place was once the site of ancient rituals, and the missing children appeared to have been brought here. However, the mysterious power within the forest was growing stronger. She heard the cries of children, as if they were calling out to her, but she couldn't determine the source of the sounds. Was she getting closer to them? Were these voices real? Sarah tightened her grip on her flashlight, feeling as though she was in the midst of an ancient ritual. The atmosphere was filled with mystique. Suddenly, some ghostly figures appeared before her. Were they the missing children? They stood there, their faces blurred, as if guiding her, then abruptly disappeared into the darkness. This forest concealed numerous enigmas, and Sarah's quest was only just beginning. Her heart was filled with determination, and no matter how threatening the darkness became, she would not retreat, nor would she give up. She knew that she was not only searching for the missing children but also seeking the truth concealed within the forest. She was prepared to confront this dark world, regardless of the risks, for the sake of the children and to uncover the truth. As Sarah ventured deeper into the ghost wood, her adventure became more complex and mysterious. The dense fog and the twisted trees seemed like witnesses to enigmatic powers, and she found herself deeply ensnared. With every step she took, strange sounds whispered around her, resembling ghostly murmurs. Her heart raced, but she didn't falter. Suddenly, a ghostly shadow emerged from the woods, seemingly the soul of one of the missing children. Sarah tried to approach it, but it disappeared before her eyes, leaving behind only a chilling breeze. This ghostly apparition appeared to guide her, and she followed it through the forest mist. As she delved deeper into the woods, Sarah discovered more ancient secrets. In a dim clearing, she stumbled upon a massive stone monolith engraved with bizarre symbols. These symbols appeared to be linked to ancient religious rituals. She tried to decipher their meaning, but they remained elusive, like phantoms in the fog. Sarah also came across an abandoned temple, a stone structure shrouded in moss and vines deep within the forest. Inside the temple, she found an ancient altar, bearing traces of long-forgotten ceremonies. Everything seemed to indicate that this forest was once the center of some ancient religious practices, a place of worship and rituals. As night fell, Sarah felt the mysteries within this forest were bottomless. Once more, she heard the cries of the missing children, seemingly right behind her. She turned to locate the source of the sound but found nothing. The forest appeared to be ever-changing, like a labyrinth trapping her within its depths. Sarah felt as though she had stepped into an ancient ritual site, a place steeped in an enigmatic aura. Her flashlight cut through the darkness, and her determination was unwavering. This forest concealed not only ancient powers but also unsolved enigmas, and her exploration was far from over. She delved deeper, discovering more ancient symbols and attempting to decode their significance. Each step represented a re-examination of the past rituals, and every stone bore witness to forgotten history. Her heart was filled with curiosity and determination because she knew that this forest held important secrets. In the darkness, she suddenly saw ghostly figures, perhaps the missing children. They stood there, with blurry faces, seemingly guiding her, and then they vanished into the darkness. This forest was full of riddles, and Sarah's quest had only just begun. 
She would press onward until she unveiled the fate of the missing children and the truth hidden within the forest. Sarah stood before the remnants of the ancient ritual site, where the air was thick with an aura of mystery, as if time had stood still in this place. The ancient stone monument was covered in mysterious symbols and inscriptions, bearing unknown meanings. They piqued her curiosity, and each symbol could hold the key to unraveling the mysteries. She knew that understanding these ancient inscriptions might provide a clue to finding the missing children. Pulling out her notebook, Sarah began meticulously recording the symbols and writings. Every detail could be vital in solving the puzzle. Although the ancient language was entirely new to her, she did not give up. Her relentless spirit and curiosity drove her to continue her research, and she gradually made some breakthroughs. Deciding to reconstruct the ancient ritual, she placed candles around the symbols and lit them as if she were the participant in an ancient ceremony. Closing her eyes, Sarah chanted the ancient incantations, attempting to invoke the power of the ancient ritual. As she chanted the incantations, a sudden, intense flash occurred, and the surrounding trees began to sway, as if infused with life. Sarah felt a powerful force enveloping her, and her heart raced. This was not just mimicry, it seemed she had genuinely triggered some form of power from the ancient ritual. At the climax of the ritual, Sarah felt herself guided to a new place. Before her stood a massive, ancient gate, radiating a mysterious glow. Sarah understood that this gate might lead to clues about the missing children. Without hesitation, she pushed it open and stepped bravely into the unknown. In this chapter filled with mysterious forces and the unknown, Sarah not only unraveled some of the secrets of the ancient ritual but also embarked on new adventures and challenges. Her journey of exploration would continue, and readers would follow her as they anticipated more unknown and mysterious discoveries. This chapter marked a turning point in her courageous story, full of expectations and surprises. As Sarah ventured into this surreal new world, her senses were profoundly shaken. The surroundings became bizarre and otherworldly, as if she had stepped into an ancient and mysterious ritual ground. Strange creatures and peculiar markings abounded, hinting that she was getting closer to unraveling the mysteries within the forest. She began to feel a powerful energy surging around her, the very force she had been seeking all along. This force connected with the ancient symbols, like a path of light leading to an unknown destination. Sarah followed this energy, determined to unlock the fate of the missing children. However, as she explored, Sarah began to encounter the guardians, once participants in the ancient rituals, they had now become supernatural beings. Possessing extraordinary powers, they attempted to hinder her progress, but her determination outweighed any threat. She knew she had to engage in a decisive battle with these guardians to continue forward. Sarah left marks at every corner of the new world, ensuring she could find her way back. She continued to uncover the secrets of the ancient rituals, intricately tied to this new realm. This adventure was filled with unknown dangers and challenges, but Sarah understood she had to persevere because she wasn't just searching for the missing children but also unraveling the enigma of the ancient rituals. Her courage and determination would guide her towards the ultimate showdown, revealing the secrets of this new world. Sarah's flashlight cast a faint glow in the ancient forest, shrouded in thick mist. She knew she was on the verge of uncovering the truth of this place, but she also felt the tension in her heart. As she pressed forward, the ancient trees seemed to grow even more peculiar. Their branches twisted into strange shapes, as if the souls of the trees were influenced by some otherworldly force. The ancient symbols etched on the tree trunks appeared increasingly mysterious in the dim light, narrating the history of the forest. Suddenly, Sarah heard the voices of the children. Their cries and calls filled the air. Anxious, she searched for the source of the sounds and finally found them deep within a thicket. The missing children were huddled on the ground, surrounded by ancient ritual artifacts. They looked weak and frightened. Sarah held the children in her arms, attempting to comfort their fears. She gently reassured them that she was here to rescue them and take them home. 
However, the children's eyes still held fear as they explained to Sarah that this forest concealed a powerful and ancient force, one that couldn't be easily confronted. Sarah understood that she had to unravel the mysteries of this forest to protect the children and halt the spread of this dark force. She began to study the ancient symbols and ritual artifacts carefully, attempting to decipher their meanings and purposes. Over time, Sarah gradually unraveled the secrets of the forest. She discovered that this place was once an ancient sacred site where people conducted mysterious rituals to gain power. However, some power had spiraled out of control, leading to the children's disappearance and turning this forest into a perilous place. In the end, Sarah found a way to tame the ancient power and seal it. The atmosphere of the forest gradually returned to tranquility, and the children started to overcome their fears. They were grateful for Sarah's help, and Sarah realized that the journey of exploration and mystery solving had made her stronger and braver. Sarah and the children walked out of the forest together, stepping into a new life. This story teaches us that no matter how great the challenges and the unknown, the spirit of courage and exploration can guide us to uncover the truth, solve mysteries, and create a brighter future. Sarah and the missing children had finally escaped from the mysterious forest. They emerged from the woods, returning to the real world, but the memories of their journey remained etched deep within their hearts. All was calm once more as the children were reunited with their families, and their parents felt an overwhelming sense of relief. Yet, they all knew that the ancient forest still existed, its power undiminished. Sarah had grown stronger through this experience and was determined to share her story with the world, as a warning to all who might heed it. She wrote about her adventures in the forest and published her account, which became a bestseller, capturing the attention of many. Despite leaving the forest behind, Sarah and the children understood that the ancient power still lingered in the shadows, waiting for another time to emerge. They vowed to keep their secret closely guarded to prevent further calamity. This tale reminds us that ancient, mysterious forces exist in the world, capable of miracles and disasters alike. When faced with such powers, courage and wisdom are key to triumph. This is the story of Sarah and the missing children, an adventure full of mystery and revelation that will forever remain in the hearts of those who dare to be brave. In the darkness, a glimmer of light always remains for those who have the courage to seek it. This is their story and the story of all the courageous souls.